Hey everybody, this is Alex Packlin, and today we'll cover a cool West Coast style blues song by William Clark. <laughs> This song has many nuances, and first of all, just as many songs that have tom blocking, it has texture. It sounds like this. If you listen to harmonica music, you probably heard it many times. It's done like this. Breathe in the k or t articulation, or the mixture of both. which is a short note, then breathe in again, and this time articulate k and tom block the two holes on the left at the same time. This song also has many fast phrases such as or I will show you an exercise that will help you master these. Set a metronome at a comfortable for you tempo, right now it's gonna be 60 BPM, and play this. So you play triplets on three holes, it can be different holes as well, not just 4, 5, 6, but 3, 4, 5, or 5, 6, 7, or 6, 7, 8. At the slow tempos you would switch the holes rapidly. But as you increase the tempo, there will be a point where you will just slide on the harmonica. Move it gradually. I'm gonna show an example in a higher tempo. This is 120 BPM. Now a higher tempo, 150. 
and a higher one, 180. Whatever the tempo is, maintain the rhythm, make sure the notes sound strong and don't let them be sloppy. So now let's start learning the tune. Each verse in it has its own theme, where for 8 bars it's usually one phrase repeated. Check this out. This is the first one, let's break it down. The first phrase is... And then it repeats, and then the phrase for the 5 chord... And the next one... The next verse, with the shorter notes... Let's break it down. Also, most of the notes in the song are draw notes, so make sure you exhale air before you play the phrases. The first phrase in this verse is... Notice that before you go to the seventh low, you inhale on those notes. You do a slide on inhale. Second one. And then you repeat those two phrases. The last one on the five step is... The next verse, which repeats two times, by the way. Let's break it down. The main phrase is... And sometimes you play... So you do a bend on 5 draw. You repeat this phrase and the phrase on the 5 step is... Notice that before that last phrase, you really need to exhale air, because it's a long phrase on draw. The next verse is the same, and the verse after that is... So the phrase is... And the phrase on the 5 step is... The next verse. So the, in so in this verse you play one phrase three times. Here it is. You bend down the fourth draw in it, and the second part of this phrase. The 
the next verse. So again, the phrase that repeats three times. Notice that you also play an octave on one and four blow. The next verse. So slowly the main phrase sounds like this. You make an emotional bend on 4 draw using the 5 draw as well. And then this phrase repeats with the less of a bend on the last note. The phrase on the five step. Let me play it once again with clicking the beats. One, two, three. The next verse, which repeats two times. Let's break it down slowly. So the main phrase is once again. So you play a bend on four draw, including the five draw and then you play on holes 1 and 2. You also add a vibrato on 4 draw. So you repeat this phrase and on 5 step you have Then this verse repeats although the then this verse repeats although the ending in the last one is different. Check it out. Let's cover the ending. From the five step it goes like this. So once again, just the part starting on 6th draw. You finish on 1-4 blow octave. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. This song really sounds badass if you play it with a guitar in the unison. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. This song really sounds badass if you play it with a guitar in unison. Check out my blues harmonica course, the link is right here. Sign up for private lessons if you want to learn cool songs like this and techniques that involve them. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.